and welcome everyone to the next episode on anubhavtrainings.com with anubhav learning series in our today's session we are going to address a very important warning or error which is coming to most of you in the latest version of abap system while creating a abap managed data procedure most of you nowadays getting this error call session client dependent or client independent in the current version of the language is missing that's the issue many of you are facing when it comes to abap managed data procedure especially in the latest version of abap on cloud system so we will try to see how to solve this issue in fact this error is very good for us because it clearly tells me that now the abap managed data procedure can do automatic client handling which was earlier only possible with cds views and earlier in amdp we used to pass a client as a input parameter from our application layer to handle the client from the database or basically read only the client dependent data but now the good news is it's managed by the compiler it's managed by the engine and we don't have to explicitly pass the session client to the amdp it automatically naturally returns the current client data to you in the output so let's go ahead and see an example of creating an abap managed data procedure now in our abap on cloud system and then we are going to see how to work with it so now we head over to the abap on cloud system and i do have a package here where i am going to create an abap managed data procedure so let's do zcl anubhav amdp issue or amdp updates so we're going to create an abap managed data procedure with updates and add the marker interface and we will create a very simple amdp function to read some customer data from a database table so now i can come back and define a amdp function and let's call the function name as uh, get customer details or get customer by id and this is an amdp function which would expect an import parameter as business partner id type my data element which i have already created in the system id and in return it's going to export the return value the return result value type my database table and perhaps one of the column i would like to return in the output so now you can see uh, the import implementation is missing so we can use quick fix to create the implementation good and we can specify the default structure by database procedure for language sql script and we will just say um, options read only and using my database table and i will put my database table business partner table and now i will select the company name property from my database table into my data variable which is output result yes where my business partner id matches with the parameter bp id great so that's a pretty much a simple sql script i think the into clause has to come here the position matters and i save and now you see the error in the new abap system indeed in the abap on cloud latest release so it says that you must mark the session handling because now amdp supports session handling like cds so we have to provide the syntax to solve this issue even you when you try to do quick fix now in this case it might not work yeah so when i'm just trying to go back and right click and do quick fix it doesn't help me it doesn't help me much yeah so what is the solution for this so you have to tell the, the engine that it has to take care of client handling by itself 
And to be able to do that, you are going to go back and add an additional uh, predicate, additional options, EMDP options. And the option is going to be CDS session client. And it's client dependent. Absolutely. I save this and Vahala, you can see the syntax error is gone. I will also add my interface now for if underscore abap class run and implement the main function as always. We do in abap and cloud environment to test my MDP now. So I'm just going to call the get customer by ID. Just going to pass a customer ID. Going to get the data in the output with inline data declaration. And I'm just going to print this data out. Perfect. So let's print the data out and let me just grab an ID. So I'll open my database table. Just grab an ID of a of a customer for testing purpose and pass that ID over here. And we're just going to go back to check the console. Absolutely. I press F9. And Vahala, you see Peer Computing Services is the customer. Exactly. So that is how exactly we have got the output when it comes to our data set. Fine. Nice. Great. So that is the solution when it comes to working with ABAP Managed Data Procedure with new a BAP engine, you have now the direct client support and I don't have to pass the client parameter, neither I have to fire a where condition to check for the client. It's automatically taking care of the client handling. Fabulous. I hope you enjoyed this video and this help you to solve the issue with new ABAP engine. In case you're facing this issue in your existing system with the MDP, if you like the content, kindly hit the like button, share and subscribe this video with your friends and colleagues in the WhatsApp group so they can also solve the problem when it comes to the EMDP. With that, Anubhav signing out. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video. Goodbye.